What is going on? How about this? I'm outside and there's snow. Kinzua Bridge. Been here before, uh, years ago. I don't think I really recorded anything. I probably took some pictures. Um, last night, probably about 10 o'clock, get a call from Dragon. He's like, how do you feel about leaving a couple hours? <laughs> Go on a little trip. So we all took naps and we came out here to do a little social distancing out here at Kinzua Bridge and the Kinzua Viaduct. A little bit of history on this. Um, uh, begun in 1881. It was an old railroad bridge and uh, in 2003 tornado partially destroyed it and it was at the point it was destroyed um, it was the highest and longest still in service railroad bridge at the time and they were um, fixing it they were actually restoring it and uh, the the crews are out there storm rolled in they called it a day they came back the next day and the bridge was partially destroyed. Uh, so we're gonna go out here and check this out. There's actually um, a glass floor in this. Um, you can see right down through. It's pretty cool. And uh, oh, there's a little interactive thing over here. You have some info on that board. Oh, hey, that's ice. Uh, it's back home. It's going to be like in the 50s and uh, it's only in like the 30s right now here. Yeah, so this is some of the information here. Um, active railroad, winds of change, drain the park. Let's see, where does it say? The information, legacy. It's, I don't see it here. Devil monkey. The hell is a devil monkey? They got Bigfoot out here? And they call him the devil monkey? <laughs> I, I, I'm not kidding. It's a wooden footprint. Devil monkey, number 23. Well, I hope I see a devil monkey. I want to see a devil monkey. Okay. That is the bridge. We're going to go out to it. Let's check it out. So last time I was here, this building was not here. This was all a construction zone. Um, this is a fairly new center. And there is down underneath here, there is a hiking trail takes you down to the valley floor. Look, stay on the path, Panda. Can't take her anywhere. Actually, they take me places. I don't take them anywhere. So, and they've also put in um, a rail trail Knox and Kane Rail Trail. I don't know where it goes, but it is pretty cool. And this, this is cool. There's still rail, uh, rails on the bridge. Very excited. As long as my selfie stick holds up. Let's stay on the trail. It does say stay on the trail. Shortcutting this rest of it. Last time I made it down to there, and I started to go down further, and I felt like crap. Was oh, up. I went like <laughs> oh, you went all, all the way, down. All the way yeah. down to the floor of the valley. Yeah, it's like 300 feet down, right? Yeah, it's far. That's, I don't know if any of that came through. down there what's 
left. Your screen up. Yeah, so right down here, you can see what's left of the bridge. And that's what they were working on. And it all got blown down. than I thought. So we got some some improved hiking trails down here. At its highest point, this is 300 feet above the valley floor. I think the observation deck here is 300 feet above the floor. And watch that is like that is ice. Alright, that's not. Stand on a piece of glass 300 feet above the floor. And surprisingly, I'm okay with it. But there's a damage, and there is a decent view all the way around. It's really slick if you come in on the front here. Yeah, I, well, I don't want to step on it because maybe, maybe stepping out, you get the whole ring is slippery. Alright, so I'm not going to take you guys too far because this is super slick right now. But, yep. Yeah, it's a bit of a drop off. So, so that's uh. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna hang out here for a minute. Then we will hand us off to the group that's coming up behind us. on the Kinsua Creek Trail. We're gonna go down along the bridge. We'll see how far down we make it. As you can see, that's not a rock scramble. Those are stairs. These are some serious freaking stairs they got in here. Look at these things. <laughs> From the bridge, they look like normal steps. But you gotta like jump down these things. They're huge. That one sucks. I'm gonna go this way then. See if this one sucks any less. Less sucky. So, yeah, the this trail is marked as more difficult. I don't think there is a less difficult trail in the park. So it's just a real trail. True. Is that part of the park, though? Maybe. 
it's more difficult than staying in the parking lot. Oh, yeah, it should probably be on the steps, not walking on the side. You get a very interesting view of the bridge from down here. Well, we are on our way in. I, if I could have got the camera launched quick enough, I would have got a video shot of it. But we saw, we're coming out of, what was that, Smessport? We saw the first two bald eagles when you saw them? Yeah. All right, so two bald eagles. And then as they flew over, looked up, there was four more bald eagles flying above them. About five minutes down the road, Dragon points off the side and there's a, an eagle just chilling out on the side of the road. Jumped up and flew right in front of the car and then took off into the trees. It was really cool. So we're at the bottom of the steps now. And we are... I don't know how well that's going to turn out. But up above me there is that platform I was just standing on about 10 minutes ago. So we're down, it's not 300 feet, it's 225 feet. There's a sign uh, at the other end and I didn't see it there. I thought it was two or 300, but it's not 225, it's still pretty high. But, so we're at the end of what they were able to save. And we're gonna head down the trail here. A lot, a lot less steep here, a lot smoother. And we'll be able to see um, the wreckage um, get down to the uh, Kinzua Creek um, and up on the other side there. I'm not sure how far up we'll go, um, but it's pretty cool. I, I didn't get down here last time. The last time I was here, I stayed up at the bridge and I made it down to like where, right where this starts to come down. But I was feeling, I, had, uh, I think I had food poisoning or something that week and I was really feeling kind of crappy. So I, I just drove out here, I checked out for a little bit and then went back. So. Oh, I thought the trail went that way. It does not. The trail goes that way. <laughs> I don't know what kind of birds those are, but they are happy. So we are down at the bottom of the valley here. Here's the bridge, and uh, so they've rerouted, Panda saw that they rerouted the trail away from the wreckage. They don't really want people going out there because as this sits, the longer it sits, the more it rusts, the more unstable it gets, the more dangerous it becomes. Uh, while it would be cool to go out there and take a look at it, um, it's a big pile of metal. And we saw it from the top. And there's no chance, nobody needs, you know, like a couple tons of rusted steel falling on them to get a picture. That would be ridiculous. Uh, and then there's uh, what's left of the, the bridge over on the other side. There's Dragon taking the picture. There's quite a bit of snow here. Good two or three inches in some spots. So this is Kinzua Creek. What's that? This is what it feels like to safely go on a <laughs> Panda made it without falling. Seems like a lot of bridge to go over a little creek. But it's worth going over the valley and then the water. That's a pretty good look at the wreckage down here. Yeah, Kurt. When I was down here before, this wreckage was in front of us. I was on the other side of that, on the other side of the creek. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So this is they really rerouted this. Well, this was this was like a rough trail. It wasn't like so nicely defined. I know it's not coming down on a GoPro. It was little birds. There's trails off to the sides here, all over the place. There's three 
stepping stones right across. Three stepping stones right across. Yes, sir. And you can see why they are, uh, they'd rather you not go out there. There's a trail that goes over there, but that is a mangled mess of giant steel girders. Yeah, climbing around in that, probably not the greatest idea. But that made a sound when it came down. If it made a sound when it came down, I doubt you could hear it over the sound of the hurricane or the tornado. Good point. So, this is one of the... I just picked these things up and just did that with them. Picked them up and just threw them. I mean, they're not even on the other sides. I mean, some of them are like these ones are on them, but some of these are just completely lifted up and moved. All right, we're gonna start heading back up. Dragon and Panda are ahead of me a little bit. And uh, see what goes on after this. Still pretty early, it's like, uh, we left at 4.30. It's only, it's only quarter after 10 in the morning. So, yeah, so we're gonna start heading up and see what we're doing after this. gonna do it for Kinzua Bridge State Park. Um, I don't know what we're doing next, but I'll find something. My nose is all dry. I feel like I gotta sneeze. But if I sneeze, CDC might come get me. Uh, all right, well, thanks for watching the video. We'll see what we're gonna do next, and that'll probably be another video if it's something interesting. See you in the next.